Hello and welcome to another plan with me in my work A5 Franken planner. Um, this week I'm using the B Suite kit from Paper and Gumption. It's a principal sticker kit. I love this kit so much. I'm using it in my A5 and in my family Franken planner. So you will see this kit twice this week on videos. I don't care. It's my last week planning in these planners before I move into my happy planners. So. I'm just going to run you through what's in each, what's in the kit. I haven't printed the full kit because the full kit is immense. There are so many pages. I've only printed out what I'm going to use. So you've got your full boxes, some labels, your heart box, heart checklist boxes, some heart checklists down the side there. You've got some labels, some half boxes, your date covers, washi strips, half a uh, full box. Some more washi bits, weekend banner, three heart checklists. So this this kit is massive, so this isn't everything you get. Um, got glitter headers, functional deco, uh, just some deco, some little functional deco bits here, some script bits here. These beautiful toolboxes with the girls in, some work labels, some more pretty boxes down the bottom, and then you've got your script, your functional deco. Some more functional bits down the side. Uh, you've got your sidebar items. So there is a lot in this kit. I'm gonna go off now, cut this all out, and I will be right back to get into the planning. Okay, so we are back. This week um, I'm using the Stadler Tri Plus Fine Liner in the 0.3 tip, which is the nice tiny tip. I've taken my inserts out. These are inserts from the Planable Tidbit and I will link those down below. I've cut all my stickers out, so we're gonna go through in a minute. Um, this is my last week using this planner as a work planner. I will be moving into my mini happy planner, which I purchased from Susie Stickits um, with the vertical layout. So I'll be moving into that in July. So I'm looking forward to using that. I will still be using this planner, but I'm going to be using it purely as a journal and mental health planner. From now on, all my work will be going into the mini happy planner. So to start off with, I am going to just pop these to one side. And I'm gonna go through and pop down my husband's work schedule. And I've got the little work stickers from the kit. So I'll go on, pink, yellow, no, he's not in, he's in Thursday. Purple, green and pink. He's working Saturday and Sunday. So I'm gonna go through and pop those down. Um, I have finished all the monster stickers. So they are available to purchase either as the, the pack of five or as individual sheets. Um, absolutely love them. They are so cute. Um, if you've watched my large plan with me, you'll see I've actually used them this week. And I can't wait to get some more going. They are just the best little monsters you could ask for. Um, I've also got quite a lot of filming to do this week, so I want to do a, a uh, planner setup in my large, my classic happy planner. I want to do a planner setup in my mini happy planner. I want to do monthly, um, do some monthlies as well. So, yeah, we'll going to be quite a busy day on my filming day but it is going to be so much fun to do as I said I'm really excited to move into my new planners um, it's the first time I've really spent a lot of money well I say a lot of money I didn't spend that much money but it's the first time I've invested in a, a planner hello Crowley it's Crowley come to 
join us. Hello? Hello, baby. So I'm currently trying to put stickers down now with a kitten on my shoulder. <laughs> Baby, can you? So for those of you that don't know, I am cat crazy. We've got three cats. We've got Crowley, Azarath, and Megatron. The little one that you've just seen was Crowley. So I'm just gonna pop these ones off to the side and I'm gonna focus on this sheet for a minute. I did cut out this toolbox of the girl with the purple hair. I love this box. This is probably one of my favorites of the whole kit. So I'm just gonna pop this one down. I'm going to pop this down at the bottom here. Um. I like the quotes as well, live more, worry less, really fits in with the, the kit itself. I'm going to pop in a weekly tracker just so I've got a bit of a space to pop down any events for this week. Pop that down there. And on Wednesday, we've got the window repair coming in. Which is nice because that'll have the window fixed before we go away on holiday. So that's that bit done. I'm going to move over to this bit here. So I'll start off with this bit of washi and I'm just going to pop this down the side here. I love that. I love this kit. I love the colours. I am a huge fan of bees. I love bees to bits. Um, Fill in my habits. That's my emails. My Facebook. My Twitter. And my Instagram. Crowley, come on, baby. Down you go. <laughs> okay. So let's move on then. Oh, pardon me. That, my back just clicked there and that really hurt. So let's move on to the, the day today. Start off on Monday with a date cover. The, the 26th, 21st. I'm going to add in a full box checklist. Okay, then I'm going to pop in a Full box, I'm probably going to use that one. I like that one. Okay, I'm going to use that one. My kittens are just going mad today. I don't know what's gotten into them, but yeah, they're having a, a nice play about. So let's pop down my full box down here. Add in um, I'm gonna add in a plain half box. I'm just gonna pop that down here. 
and that is so I can just write down what my idea is that I'm working on that day. So I'm moving on to Tuesday. Let's get my date date cover. This is the twenty second. Um, I'm going to go with a floral full box. Um, get a heart checklist as well. I'm going to put my heart checklist on this side. I have found that having all this space, I'm really able to jot down my ideas, get those thoughts going. And it's just really, really helping me to get the creativeness that I want. So I'm going to pop down a patterned half box now. I'm just going to put this here. That's just to mark, again, what my focus for the day is. So moving over to Wednesday, put the date cover down. I've got that little bit of Y showing there. So what I'm going to do is just cut off a, a section of white sticker. And just pop that there just to cover that Y up so it's not 24th. What am I? What? 20, 25th. I was looking at the wrong week when I dated these. 26th. Okay. So on Wednesday and Thursday, this is the double box. So I'm going to pop one on Wednesday, one on Thursday. So I've got that double box going across the two days. Um, because with these inserts, you can't do it over the weekend. Um, because the Saturday and Sunday are actually split. So doing it over Tuesday, Thursday makes a bit more sense. I suppose I could have done it Friday, Saturday. I just thought it would be nice to have it midweek. Okay, I'm going to pop down my checklist. And my half box for my focus. Okay. So that's Wednesday, so moving on to Thursday. Uh, date cover to start with. And that is the 27th. I've already got my full box down, I'm going to get my heart box down. half box just to pop my focus in 
I like this idea of having one focus each day. And it does change from day to day. I'm moving on to Friday and Saturday. So before I was putting things like um, upload or shop as my focus and it just wasn't focusing me the way I wanted it to. So by putting the half box down there, I can do a more detailed focus. So for example, I could say design three sticker kits as my focus for the day and that would be what I would do. I'm going to use the tea caddy and teapot full box. Um, I'll pop my checklist down. So it just gives me a more detailed focus on what I'm doing. And that really is helping with the creativity. I want to say it's not a creativity block as such, but it's just been a bit of a, a stumbling block almost. And so I'll start trying to focus on something and I just get distracted. So this should help for hopefully focus my mind a little bit more. So it's Saturday. Pop down my date cover. Where's the 29th? Can't believe we are at the end of June already. I'm going to put down this floral box. It's the end of June. This year has gone so quick. I know it's, people say it every year, oh, this year's gone so fast. But this one really has. It doesn't feel like yesterday I was celebrating my little girl's second birthday. And now I'm trying to plan her third. So I'm just popping down my half box. And I'm, you know, I'm getting ready to plan her third birthday. She will be three. My son is going to secondary school. And I was talking to my sister earlier on the phone. And we just, you know, can't believe it. This was the, the strange little alien creature they handed us wrapped in a blanket. Who was completely and utterly dependent on me. Is now grown up. So I'm just going to move over to Sunday. Pop my date cover in. And uh, it's, it's hard because I know I've got to let him grow up, but I still want to protect him as much as I can. And I suppose that's what mothers do. We protect our children as much as we can. The 30th. Um, so I'm going to use this one that says Be Sweet. Anyway, I digress. Um, I'm hoping to try and get a, a kit in this month. The artwork that I'm working on, I'm, I'm struggling with it a bit. I really don't seem to feel, I'm just going to use a purple half box. I don't seem to feel the, the artwork's just not coming together. And so I've done it and I've redesigned it and I've redesigned it and it's just not coming together the way I want. So moving onto the sheet, I'm going to just pop down a weekly checkbox on the next week bit. Just so I can make notes of things that are happening the next week. Um, and then I'm going to use this that is not straight at all. So, I don't know, do, do other people get these, these creative blocks? And you're just looking at things and it just doesn't want to click. I'm going to use this half box of the teacup. Full box, sorry. Things just don't want to 
snap into place. So, yeah, that, that's how I'm feeling. I might, I don't want to put the strip of washi down. No, I'm not going to put that down. Um, so, yeah, that's this week. I'm going to pop it back into my planner and then I will flip you through. Okay, so I've just popped that back in my planner. I've written in my husband's work schedule because I've forgotten to do that. And if I didn't do it now, I would completely forget. Um, so this is how it's looking. Loving the colours on this kit. It's got that beautiful summertime vibe. It's got the bees, which are just the best. Um, it's an absolutely stunning kit. One of my absolute favourites. So yeah, that is it. If you enjoyed this video, then please don't hesitate in hit hitting the like button. If you want to see more videos like this, then hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Lots of exciting things coming in. As I said, we've got the monthly plan with me's coming in. We've got weekly plan with me's in my happy planner. So lots of exciting times to come. Anyway, you take care now. Bye-bye.